Uh, my name is Gareth Bonello. Um, I play uh, under the stage name The Gentle Good, and I'm a sort of folk musician from Cardiff in South Wales. Uh, I first got into making music um, when I was sort of uh, in my early twenties. I sort of started playing open mics around Cardiff, that kind of thing. And I got into folk songs and started investigating old folk songs to perform at open mics, and then from that slowly developed to write my own stuff as well. And so it's kind of a, quite a slow process, but that's how I got about doing it. I applied for the Musicians in Residence uh, China program um, initially um, because it just sounded like a really fascinating project and I thought I had a, an idea that could really work with it so um, when it got to the sort of application I was just kind of really, really I think enthusiastic um, and had quite a clear idea of what I was going to, sort of what I wanted to do and I think that I was lucky that um, people at PRS and British Council obviously liked the idea. So. There were some similarities between um, the folk music of Wales and the folk music of China. Um, more actually, there was more similarities for me between the sort of the poetry and the, the words and the themes of the songs. I suppose folk music is kind of universal in that the themes are always the same. It's always about, it's about love or travelling or loss and all that kind of stuff. So a lot of the sort of poems that I was reading which from uh, sort of the poet Li Bai were reminded me of. Welsh traditional songs, you know, um, but the music, Chinese music, traditional music was very different to Welsh folk music, you know, um, and that was a real eye-opener and that was really fascinating to explore. I've changed the way that uh, I make music since the project um, in many ways, I think. Um, when I was out there, I did get a lot of time to sort of uh, to practice and write uh, new music and I was trained to sort of imitate lots of sounds on the guitar that I was hearing from the Chinese instruments. So. I ended up actually becoming a better guitar player, I think, because I actually sort of was developing different techniques and things while I was in China. Um, also, since coming back, I think I've just, I'm have much more open-minded about music from anywhere in the world, and most of the stuff that I listen to now is world music, because it's just, it's just such, a, it's such a vast amount of stuff to explore, and it's really inspiring. So that has also made me think about sort of how my own music sits in the context of the whole planet rather than just trying to appeal to some people in Wales or the UK. Uh, yeah, I recently went to Nagaland in northeast India, which was a real, yeah, that was a real fascinating experience. Um, we were out um, as part of a project to um, engage with musicians from uh, this remote region up in, uh, up in Kohima, um, which is the capital. And, you know, there were so many different groups of people from Assam and from other parts of the northeast, and there were so many different languages and different styles and um, different music. Um, it was really fascinating, and we went to the, um, the Hornbill Festival, uh, and we heard sort of traditional uh, tribal music there, and it was, that was something else, you know. So again, it was just a really, sort of really fantastic experience, and we did come along, uh, along uh, with lots of new ideas out of that. I'm working on um, another album. Um, I'm kind of taking stock, I think, after the last album, which is a kind of a very long project and a, a kind of a concept album. I'm kind of uh, taking stock and seeing what I think of traditional Welsh music and my own writing and where that's going. So I'm kind of doing this uh, album, which is slowly taking shape, and I'm hoping it's going to be out next year. So I'm, 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 but the new song's are coming along, thankfully. <laughs> I've been working uh, with George of Ruth Williams, um, who's a, a lovely, lovely harpist. And harpist from Wales. Um, I've also been working uh, lots as always with Richard James from Gorky's Psychotic Monkey and uh, uh, a bassist called Callum Duggan uh, who is uh, in several bands um, but uh, most notably I suppose Little Arrow and Winter Villains uh, he's been playing with. So um, yeah I'm, I'm various other sort of characters around Cardiff as well I've been working with.